Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol ACB. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. If you're not sure what I mean by 30 minute, I do offer an explanation video at that link. So if you go there, I'll explain in detail. Did this analysis on Thursday, so that is where the green line annotations are coming into play here. And unfortunately, uh, it's right back to where it was and the, the nice movement that occurred a few days ago. I mean, you got to give credit or credit to that right there. Very, very nice step in the right direction. However, ultimately, that was just simply a dead cat bounce because now the price has quite literally gone right back to where it all started. So you look at where it closed and then you match that up over here. And like I said, I mean, when you, when you have these sorts of triangles that form, not the type of triangles that you want to see. So back to the drawing board would be another way to look at it. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and just get rid of that line there. It served its purpose. Uh, and really the, the, the straightest way to look at this from the resistance side of things is that purple line there, which I've talked about time and time again. Actually, I'm curious. So let's just offer up a little bit more context. So you can see that ever since the price fell back below the purple line uh, from back here a few weeks ago, price has bounced, got somewhat close to it, rejected, immediately rejected, immediately rejected, right there, immediately rejected. So it's just been a thorn in the side, and I've talked about this time and time again, and it remains a thorn in the side. Now, I'm not saying this thing can't bounce because there's been plenty of bounces along the way. There is a great bounce, turned out to be a dead cat. Nice bounce, turned out to be a dead cat bounce. And then again today, nice bounce turned out to be a dead cat bounce. So all bounces should be looked at very skeptically until the price can prove itself and quote unquote prove itself being defined as not only breaking above that purple line, but staying up above it. So that is by far the key level of resistance to continue to watch going forward. As far as levels of support are concerned, I'm gonna go ahead and adjust this level down now that we have more data. And that key level right there added $1.90. If you go back through the history, $1.90, you know, give or take a penny or two was where the price found some support. And you know, to, to give to look at the, the bright side, at least this level held up as support once again, where it's had the price come down there and then just blasted down through there. That would have made the chart look so much worse. So, you know, to look at the glass is half full, at least that area was able to hold up. Uh, but yeah, as far as a nice movement from earlier in the week, that's all been wiped away. It was just a dead cat bounce. So we'll see if the price and the bulls can try to put together a new movement next week or not. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too good, way too, good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.